be coming up over there. Look at that. Look at that burrito, dude. And you got some fries too. Man. You cannot beat a good burrito. But yeah, today has been a decent day for me. Well, other than that McDonald's thing, I picked up three parcels. Well, one of them which I'll show. Some of you might be wondering, or not wondering, because not many people watch my videos, but why do you talk about your life when there's no one watching shit? This is like a kind of a video diary for me and something fun for me because over the course of the last three years doing YouTube, I realize I don't gain much followers. We coming up over there to Guzman Y Gomez. Hi, uh, could I get a, uh, a burrito with uh, ground beef? Tomato spicy. Uh, spicy. Was that in a meal today? Uh, could I also get uh, extra guacamole? Uh, it's a long wait. But they make it afresh. Okay. Alright, thanks so much. Uh. Is that good? I had to um, I had to move my car a bit because it was so sunny, and it was like blinding me. But yeah, we we just went to motherfucking ass. Guzman my Gomez up in this bitch, and uh, we ought to just. The fuck is wrong with my camera? It, I need a new camera. It's it's way too hot in here. Oh man, it's it's. Oh, it's good weather today. Today is good weather. Ow. But yeah, first time doing fucking these reviews in my car. Can't get the angles right, eh? I, I can't I can't seem to get the angles right. Um in terms of uh like see okay, can I sit back a bit? Like if I sit too back, it's better. It's not as close up. I noticed my first two videos were a bit too close up. But, um, if I sit too back, like, there's not enough light in this car. But, yeah, we got, we got a treat for you guys. Okay, let me just show you what I got, first of all. Okay. So, we got some fries, right? Some Guzman's, Guzman Y Gomez fries. Mmm. They're salty. I think there's, like, seasoning... Some paprika or something. Man, you can't really tell, but there is some seasoning. Like, they like Cajun fries in a way. Mexican fries, they taste really good. I would have got the queso fries with the cheese, the jalapenos, the, you know, the pico, the gallo, the tomatoes, but... That would have been too, uh, too filling. And besides, I already ate before today. Um, guess I didn't, didn't tell you guys because I didn't upload that video. But earlier today, we got some nice... I like bottled, frozen soft drinks more than canned. Tastes better. And the fizz, the, the cut action on your throat, it's way more intense. That's some good cut action. Excuse me. Um, I'm going to try not to edit these too much. I think. Unedited. The only reason I edited the um, USA Foods one was because there was a lot of downtime, actually. But yeah, I had to... Hopefully the... Um, yeah, if I move, like, to... It's, it might be hard to see me. That's why I was so close up. But anyway... So what what did we get? We got a um We got a did they give us any tissues? No tissues, but luckily you always come prepared when you fucking eat out a lot. Well I don't eat out all the time. 
maybe like twice a week or something. Yeah, I'd say twice a week on average. But you got you get, you got a um, spicy ground beef burrito with extra guac. Let's take a bite of this bitch. Okay, I've had this before. This is my regular whenever I come to Guzman Y Gomez, which is I guess one of if not the best, probably one of the best, probably the best fast food chain in Australia that sell Mexican food. We have Taco Bell actually. We got Taco Bell recently here, like, maybe not recently, two years ago. I haven't tried it yet, uh, maybe that's for another video, but I heard people say it's not that good, so. Mm. Or at least some. Um, the menu is definitely different to American, the American menu. So, it's not that good. <clears throat> Let me take another bite. A lot of cars coming by. Look at that. Look at that burrito, dude. And you got some fries too. Can we get them in focus though? I need to back up a bit. I need to back up a bit. I need to hide. Actually, I don't know. But you can see it's got beans. It's got... Maybe it's better if I just go like this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. You got beans, you got... Rice, you got guacamole, <clears throat> you got, um, I can't see shit, hold up. <clears throat> I might need to edit this video, <laughs> but anyway. <clears throat> you got beans, you got rice, you got guacamole. That's better. And you got ground beef. And you got like pico de gallo or something. So. Dropping on my seat. And this is a oh shit! <laughs> I oh, I fucked up nearly. Spill my drink. Um, <clears throat> this is a busy place. Wait, hold up. There we go. Ma'am, you cannot beat a good burrito. I love Mexican food because I grew up here, I guess, and also watching. YouTubers, you know. Oh, look at that. That's a girthy, girthy burrito. Why is it not focusing? There you go. Excuse me, there's something wrong with my camera today. I think I have it on... Is it on autofocus? Or is it on manual focus? Ah, fuck it. But yeah, I wasn't um, that hungry today, I guess. So I didn't order any queso fries. Um, <clears throat> because <laughs> earlier today I tried to go to McDonald's, and I did, but I went to get the... Cheesy mozzarella sticks, which is one of the new creations. Cheesy mozzarella sticks, but they didn't have any. Where can I get these? Uh, can I get your mozzarella sticks? 
I thought you rejected them anymore. Oh, you don't serve them anymore. You know, maybe other McDonald's had some, but this one didn't have any. And I swear, probably, uh, now might be for another video, but I tried their um, creme brulee pie. That was pretty decent. But that's all I had. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's weird, because I swear they might have the mozzarella sticks. I just want to do them for a video, but they might have them in other restaurants. Like, it's in certain limited participating restaurants. Um, because yesterday, I actually went and had McDonald's again, but I asked for, like, it was probably not one of the popular ones, but they actually, I asked for nuggets. They actually, I said one of each sauce. This guy was nice, and he actually gave me one of fucking every sauce, even ketchup. Fucking, I got seven horses, uh, seven horses, seven, well, five sauces chilling at home, because they actually gave me the Cajun sauce. The one that I wanted to try last week. And I was right. The Cajun sauce out of the four limited sauce run that came out this um, month or something. Last month, I guess. July. Sichuan, Cajun. You got <clears throat> you got curry. You got um, Mighty Hot Sauce. Cajun is definitely the best. By far, by a long shot. And it might be my favorite sauce to dip my nuggets in. I wish I had more though, but whatever. I really hope it's focusing. Because, um... I don't know, my camera's acting up. It wouldn't record for some reason. For some reason, it wouldn't let me record in high FPS. I guess my camera's getting old, huh? This is my regular, whenever I go to Guzman Y Gobez, get the burrito. I don't get anything else. It's the most valuable option. I always get ground beef too because I love it the most. Oh man. Sometimes they fuck it up though. Sometimes they don't give you extra, as much guacamole as you want or as much spice. This time though, they did pretty decent. But yeah, today has been a decent day for me. Well, other than that McDonald's thing, I picked up three parcels. Well, one of them which I'll show. The other two are less important, I'd say. It's more for personal use. Like I got some insoles and some other stuff. Um, like snand, like acrylic snand. That's whatever. But, um. Might show the one, the big one that I got later. <clears throat> Some of you might be wondering. Or not wondering. Because not many people watch my videos. But, why do you talk about your life? When there's no one watching shit. This is like a, kind of a video diary for me. And something fun for me. Because over the course of the last three years doing YouTube. I've realized I don't gain much followers. Excuse me, but I don't gain any at all, like some like me, so. I don't know what you guys want to see. So at the end of the day, I do whatever the fuck I want to do, you know? But yeah, today is also um the the release date, the first release um, day of um, Bullet Train, the new movie with Brad Pitt. So I watched it today, like I always do. I always watch new movies first. And I have the review up. I don't know when. Either... 
before this video or after, I really don't know, but within the next two days. Really fun movie. Four words to describe it. Brutal, entertaining, fun, and surprising. <laughs> I'm not going to reveal too much about it, but I really enjoyed it. It's not the best, though. The, um, the story was a bit messy, but it was a pretty fun ride. I know my videos are pretty long, but it's because I talk in them, too. I'm just going further than eating. Look at that. Oh man. Yeah, the camera is fucked. For some reason, it won't scan in. It only scans in on me, which is good, I think. I hope I'm not blurry this video. It doesn't really scan in on anything else, even if I'm hiding. Something's wrong with my camera. Fuck, man. That's the thing with being doing on the fly filming. It's because sometimes you get fuck ups and stuff that goes wrong. But anyway, nearly done. And you, you can see the spicy juice leaking. They did good with the spice today. They didn't do too much good with the guacamole though. Sometimes I... <clears throat> talk midway through a sentence and then I just forget what to say. It's because I have a lot on my mind. I don't know if I mention it or not, but... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, my mom's always like, You're Chinese. Why do you like Mexican food or... <laughs> It's because I grew up here in Australia, you know? People here, man, they love their Western, you know, they love their fast food, they love their Mexican food as well, I'd say. Today, we've been having um, really windy days here. The last night and the night before. So windy, like trees going down, power going down, that kind of windy. But during the day, it's fine. <laughs> nice sunny, nice, nice day. Very nice day. As you can probably tell. But yeah. I have, a, uh, I have some plans for this channel. I don't know how today went. <laughs> I don't know if the footage I captured was good enough. It's hard when I'm by myself. So <laughs> I want to capture a lot of stuff, but... I can't because I'm driving and I don't want to crash this bitch. But yeah. Uh... Pretty messy, eh? But man, this was good. My hands dirty as fuck. Put some of this refreshment on it.
But yeah. We done. We motherfucking ass done. And I'll show you what I got as well. I might end up editing editing this a uh, little bit as well. Sometimes there's a lot of some dead space, you know. That's some clean coconut sugar. They replaced fast food establishments for some reason here in Australia. They replaced Coke Zero with coconut sugar, which arguably tastes better in a way. Honestly, I got used to it. I still, I still would have said Coke Zero was better, but maybe it's because I was used to that for such a long time. Um, that you know, but um, comparing the two, Coke Zero does taste sweeter. It does taste sweeter than coconut sugar. This tastes like, um, remember that Dr. Pepper I had? That diet Dr. Pepper I had the other day in USA Foods? That tasted like there was 100% no sugar. <laughs> uh, this is kind of like the, that of the Coke, you know? <clears throat> Ah, uh, man, why are these people parked next to me, dude? Fuck it, they're leaving. There's so many cars, so many people, holy shit. You can't see it, but, man, every so often I drive, like, there's always a car, like, every 10 seconds that drives past. Uh, but yeah, we got motherfucking ass. We got it. The Meta Quest 2. 128 gigabytes. Man, we got it. So that's what I picked up today. That was very important. I'm still waiting for the prescription lenses though. So that I... I don't want to... I, like, I don't like wearing glasses when I'm watching VR or whatever. But yeah. That's what we picked up. And... We got two random accessories. This is probably the wire, because fuck getting the MetaQuest wires, you know? Like, I mean, they upped their prices. I saw 150 AUD or something. That's a lot of fucking AUDs. Man, that's a, like 100 USD. That's a lot of money up <laughs> that they upped. So I'm glad I got it before they upped the prices. Um, <clears throat> but yeah. And also, they up their set accessories, which charging $125 Australian for a cable that plugs... That I think they ch charge it more now. I could be wrong, though. Nah, maybe they charge it $5 more. <laughs> but charging fucking that much for, like, a, um, a cable. But it allows you to do something big, I guess, and that's to play your Steam games on your PC and stuff. And stream it, but still, $125 for cable. This motherfucker cost me $30. <laughs> and it's still good. Oh, well, I read the reviews. It took a long while for me to decide. And then we got this. I'm not gonna open it, but this is the Elite Strap, which is. What? I don't. It's better than the, um. <clears throat> The, uh, the, the, the MetaQuest accessories, because I heard that Elite Strap breaks <laughs> after usage. But this got a full five stars on Amazon, so I trusted that bitch. <clears throat> but yeah. Just showing you what the fuck I'm doing. Ah, uh, we got this bad boy, right? And we had a good meal. 
be coming up with more videos shortly. But until next time. Uh, which place gives me the most sunlight? I think facing the sun, yeah. Facing the sun. Give me the best. Actually, am I able to even... Park here? I don't fucking know. I will still park here though.